that can you, that can you collocate two past tenses? That can be. It's not right. Right next. Some of the English we speak, nobody told us this past. We read them from books, from magazines, from newspapers, from good television channels. What BBC, Sky News, CNN, the news announced, good English. Update yourself. Don't be, don't be satisfied with mediocrity. Don't accept it. Don't want to excel. Make an impact. Because you'll be competing with the Americans and the Japanese and Germans of this world very soon. It's already happening. The same job I mean and globally. With the impact that has my last topic, my profession, because I cannot finish this talk without my profession, the ICT industry. You will be competing with them. So you go for the UN job, ITU job, all of the organization job. And then an American is sitting there, that's one of the, that the wish, or European, or Asia, all the questions, is just teaching out the answers. That's all best. Then you look at the city. Yeah, Lord, what is the answer? At that point, the Lord will tell you your conscience. What Paul says in the Bible, and the baby man will not walk, let him not eat. So, the baby man or woman did not study and understand, let him not be the correct answer. It's the same as that. There's no shortcut. Please, be honest. Hands up. Those of you who have a small power, you are ready to wait to spread your share books. Hands up. Good. 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 We have the passion to do. My last part is the global ICT industry. The fledging ICT industry. The fastest growing industry in the world today. I'm going to use that as an engine oil to interconnect all the things I've said to you this morning. The ICT industry, the power of knowledge. You say knowledge is power. You know why knowledge is power? Because it empowers the possessor. Knowledge is power because it empowers those who have knowledge. That is the difference. Very soon now, the world will be split between the half not caused by knowledge, deficiency, and those who have. How many of us here have internet access? Either by a Blackberry phones, or we go to some cafe, or computers at home, or computers in the office. Hands up. Please, we bring a hand up, do some quality, some statistical analysis. Please, we can say run of us. This is good. How many of you have fast internet access? That's high speed internet access. Hands up. Let me tell you what I mean by high speed internet access. When you go to a server cafe, or you have a small laptop, and you want to access browser site, when you, when you double click on the site, you know, because of the low speed, we say, plug and pray. Yeah, Lord, let it load, you know. <laughs> Online, plug and play. So when you plug and play, click, click, it's already there. All right? Before you even remove your four finger, the site is already loaded. How many of you have that kind of experience? Baby! You see, only one or two hands. Good. There's blue one. There's main one. Have you heard of main one before? How many people have heard of main one cable? You see? You see? So, there's broadband internet. Not your fault. You was, it's about to come into the land. Hinterland. US, Europe to Africa. Main one, blue one. MTR, WASP, Satri, by fiber, by God's grace, the federal government announced, I think last week, 770 for local government to have broadband access. Obama talked about this in 2008. The Canadians, the Americans, they are far, far, far ahead. You know the reason? Of all the factors of production, land, capital, labor, entrepreneurial skill, the most important now is knowledge, data and information, knowledge. What you input into productivity, I want to put it differently. 
the speed and ease with which you access knowledge on the internet, and the speed and ease with which you translate and apply knowledge into productivity locally, is what gives you a competitive advantage in any field of human endeavor. That is our only issue. Internet is a click to abundance and a click to wealth. The issue is good use of the internet. Forget about the negative value of the internet. For sure, it's a tool. It will be abused. It will be abused. The same thing with technology that they need to produce, that kind of thing, that they need to produce, that kind of thing, use with. That's the same technology that is used to produce penthouse magazine. The same technology used to produce photographic magazines. Would you say because of penthouse and photographic magazine that Newsweek and that magazine and this and that are bad? No. Or you have been a team. Look at the people you have now. So do not confuse the abuse of the tool with the goodness of the tool. Man is God's crown of creation. Don't men and women do bad things. Don't. Would you say because of that God done the mistake? Would we say that? Our creation was bad because man, man, man did, does what is wrong? No. So don't confuse the two. So with respect to ICT, have access to knowledge. Translate knowledge to boost your productivity in network. Have a domain name, have a website. How many of you have your own website? Hands up, your own website. Re read it all this. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, good, ten, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. And I will call it an infinite, an infinite, a very small number comparison to the group here. Let me give you a good analogy. My full name is Emmanuel Efion Ekuwe. That's my full name. Now, as you see me, I am localized in this space. So this is my physical presence. Okay? If you want to see me, will somebody in Yama see me now? Whoever can see me, but well, this side is church, isn't it? Good. Listen to this. My name is Emmanuel Efion Ekuwe. My physical presence is what you are seeing now. But in the ICT space, my name will be emmanuel.com.ng, for example. And when I develop my website and put the totality of my endowments, my strengths, my competences on my website, that is myself in the digital space, in the server space. Alright? So, why you need to come here physically to see my physical self? My digital self in the cyber space, once it's gone onto the internet, I am available to all of mankind with just a simple click. How can you joke with that kind of power? Ha! Man. How can you joke with that kind of power? The women in the human market, in Balogu, they don't have domain name, they have no websites. The beautiful and are they are masked, giving bouquet. People come from the loop, they come from where they from, go from simple to go there to buy. When they could have been double clicking to browse the shop on the website and you pay online, cash lights or cashless, or at the very worst, go to the tennis bank and pay. And the woman will receive an alert in Malogu. So the tenant will go the cost of the fabric and the cost of shipment to Sokoto. You save time, save energy. Remain in Sokoto to be productive. The woman in Balogu is making money. The woman in Aria Aria Market in Abba is making money in all the chat. You don't go on show, you can. So you are starving yourself to death when you have no internet presence. So I will tell you people that by one month from now, go and get a domain then. Consult the US people, uh, and I don't. Get a domain then. Get a website, launch your competencies, your productivities, your creativities, your innovative abilities on your own small site. Keep it active and developing. You'll be so shocked someone will contact you from China, from Japan, from Australia. So, your digital self in the summer space 
is at the disposal of all of mankind. While the physical self is localized in the small space, in the small state, in the small local government headquarters, in the small world, in the small church. I will have now. How then would you joke with the power to abundance? Why should you rest when there is a key to wealth? Why should you joke when you can talk click to opulence and to happiness? As we sat at the beginning, but I like saying it. What I will tell you young people is this. A businessman in summary or businesswoman is an opportunist, but a positive and creative opportunist. If there are no opportunities, there are no businesses. Have you got me? So if you want everything to be rosy, then you can't do business. I'm not, I'm not, I hope you understand me. If everything is perfect, then it's too late for you to be a businessman or woman. It's only when things are not yet right. When a lot of things that see us from loopholes, you take positive advantage of those loopholes to make money. But there must be peace. That I learned from the same US people, you know, when they came for the talk, this, uh, Mr. Bob Langley like, came to give a talk at the CTO, one of the CTO events, and he was giving a presentation on security. He said, Gentlemen, you know what? Money is a coward. Look at me, I was wondering why this guy making this step And he said, He said, Money is a coward. He said, you know why? Nobody answered. And he said, you know why man is a coward? He said, no. He said, he would never go to where there is violence. No investor will go to where there is kidnapping. No investor will go to where there is cultist activities. No investor will go to where they kill 40 students, 35 students, measure them by them and they shoot. No investor will go to where you have Bogdan. And arm robbers and hired assassins. So money runs away from insecurity. Money runs away from violence. That's why he said money is a coward. But I will call money in that context a smart coward. Because, because you will not want to go to where there is that. So business is opportunity. Those who don't want to come to Nigeria, look at FTN. I'll give you an example. 1999, 2000. Obasanjo, let's do where everything set for years and motion. Woo! Nigeria? No! Oh, how can you go there for that company? You know? Other companies abroad. T Telecom, Judge. No, Nigeria? No! Impossible place. No, no money. No, don't go there. You're going to lose your money. Those who care, they took a risk. You know why? Because they saw that there were opportunities in Nigeria. Today, I can tell you they are rolling in joy. They are rolling with joy, making billions dead. So, if there are no opportunities, there can be no business. Thank you very much.
पक्ष वस्ती रहा